up was Kathleen with Parker. And dog number two, that was Janine with Otis. Competitor number three, Sharon with Mist. Competitor number four was Kay with Lauren. Competitor number five, Lydia with Diva. Competitor number six was Gina with Dora. Competitor number seven, Zara with Parsnip. And competitor number eight, Sean with Schaefer. Competitor number nine, Anne with Nova. Competitor number ten was Patricia with Fletcher. Competitor number eleven, Martina with Shona. And competitor number twelve, Josephine with Inka. Competitor number thirteen, Maggie with Evie. Competitor number fourteen was Yvonne with Atlas. Competitor number 15, Abby with Bernard. And number 16 with Teresa with Jimmy. 17, Robin with Maisie. Number 18 was Fiona with Jura. And our final competitor was number 19, Daisy with Ben. So we're just going to, going to get them all spaced out, settled down. To, uh, ready for that presentation of the awards for this particular competition. All of the dogs and handlers this morning did a fantastic job. Very distracting environment potentially for these dogs and these inexperienced handlers, but they all did really, really well and they should be well proud of themselves. So before we, uh, before we award the prizes, Please welcome into the ring our judge for this morning, Lee Lampert, who did a fantastic job. Please give us a big round of applause. And also welcome into the ring our prize giver, Heidi Lawrence, who's the education manager for the Kennel Club and is in charge of the Kennel Club's Good Citizen Dog Scheme and the Safe and Sound Scheme. Okay, we're about ready. So, in first place was Carrot Popping Candy, handled by Maggie McDevitt, Evie, the five-year-old working sheepdog. And the first place was won after a runoff, so she had to do the round twice this morning. In Nerves weren't bad enough the first time round, I'm sure they were worse the second time. And the team that she had to run off against was Gina Gwilliam with her English Springer Spaniel Fleet Form Explorer of Amienko, or Dora for short.